In this lesson, we'll review expression of ideas, writing questions. Typically in these videos, I solve one problem. However, we have three questions, three, four, and five. They are clustered together. I will review all three. So this is sort of a daily double 800 bonus. All right, let's start at the beginning of the paragraph. Most research addressing the cognitive benefits of playing musical instruments finds that music lessons have positive effects on school-aged children as the formative years facilitate easy absorption of new skills. Young people who learn to play an instrument strengthen auditory skills, memory, and cognitive development, sensory abilities, creativity, and problem solving. So question three, young people who learn to play an instrument strengthen. This looks good. We have this infinitive to play, and we've got strengthen a verb. We know that the subject is plural, and strengthen agrees with that. If you look at the choices, we're not going to use two infinitives, to play and to strengthen. Strengthens with the S, that would suggest we have a singular subject. We don't. It's plural with people. And then is strengthening. Well, we know is singular is wrong, and also it's passive, and it's wrong for a couple of reasons. So this one is no change A. And now we're listing these different mental benefits that these young people strengthen by playing an instrument. And we're listing them. We have auditory skills. This is one. Memory and cognitive and then development. And she, this really doesn't fit. They strengthen memory and cognitive what, right? Cognitive is an adjective. It, it should be cognitive development. If you look at the choices, it's not memory but, right? There's no contrast. Memory and cognitive. These are both adjectives, right? Development. We need to modify that. So the answer for this one is C. And we're not going to split these up here with a comma either. And then question five. By contrast, some of these improvements occur because the act of playing music changes the way the mind itself work. So this final sentence is a transitional question here. So we just finished listing all these mental benefits and then we've got this next sentence. Some of these improvements because occur because it, the act of playing music, it changes the way the mind itself. We don't want a contrast. There's certainly no contrast here. And if we look at the other choices, we know it's not contrast and we know it's not however. And those are both pretty synonymous and either. You really couldn't differentiate, but there's certainly not contrast. In fact is the answer, and in fact is the same word as indeed, and this really is used to highlight or to emphasize a point that is made in the preceding sentence. And so we just finished listing all these, these benefits of um, mental development, how these young people strengthen their mind. Indeed, some of these improvements be, be occur because the act of playing changes the mind. So indeed, it really highlights or even emphasizes a point that's made, and this completely fits. Similarly, is, is in a similar fashion or, or, or likewise. And, and this is not a similar fashion. This is sort of going on and, and even adding more and, and confirming it further, the point made in the preceding sentence. And so the answer here is B.